right, guess what time it is. Hopefully my audio is recording properly. It's hot dogs and horseshoes and hand grenades time. This is update 87. I have to take a look at my notes there. And uh, yeah, if you watch the video, you'll know this is all about uh, Half-Life style weapons in H3 VR. So as you can see on the table there, we got some good uh, good weapons here. Ooh, ooh yeah. And, uh, of course, the Graviton Beamer. But uh, let's take a look at some of these new weapons. Starting with the USP match here. Which is basically a 9mm version of the USP. Hold on, let me get to the center of my play space here. Ouch, my toe. Okay, hit my toe on my bed there. But, uh, see, this is the USP regular in 45 ACP and you can notice there's one big difference other than the the uh, cartridge caliber is the fact that we get these nice little glow sights which is uh oh man I wish they they had the glow sights on the uh, on the uh, regular USB match but you know this is a half-life themed update Hold on just a second move that box out of the way <laughs> sorry so uh yeah, so this is the 45 mag does not fit obviously but we got the nine millimeter right here which let me just spawn lock into my harness it's kind of hard to not look down and uh, try to get it from like muscle memory, but it's possible. Oh, get in there. <laughs> but yeah, so, you know, it's a USP, but in nine millimeter, which is a uh, common caliber for these pistols as well. They don't just come in 45. They're also in nine millimeter and 40 is Smith and Wesson. If I remember correctly. Yeah, I think so. Oh, well, you know. All right, we've got a good look at that. Let's see if we can take some attachments on this thing. I know we can put some uh, some lasers and stuff at the bottom, but it's always a good idea to check whether you can put a suppressor on this. Yeah, you can, so muzzle brake means suppressor. Okay, let's... Uh, let me grab a suppressor here. What would be a good suppressor for a USP match? We're, uh, we're thinking maybe, uh, let's see, futuristic, right? But it's like a post-apocalypse, so maybe the oil can suppressor. All right. And then a uh, little laser here. Let's go with a... Um, Hmm. Hmm. Maybe this one. All right. So it still works with all the attachments. That's good. A little laser there. Uh, I need to reload this thing. Take out the suppressor. <laughs> All right. Yep, it's pretty much just like the uh, the uh, USB match. So, um, may, no major difference to it, except for these glow sights. Oh, but uh, all right. Let's put that down, and let's focus on this next bad boy here. The MP7 sustenance. Basically, it's an MP7 but with a integrated uh, hollow sight and grenade launcher, which this is the, what, the GP20, oh man, I can't remember the name of it, but uh, hold on just a second. GP25, okay. So it uses a uh, Russian grenade, so let me spawn one of those. Let's get this one, here we go. Okay, all the controls still work. That's nice. 
we uh it's already on um fire so you gotta be a little uh safety conscious about this thing but it's pretty much just a mp7 but with a little hollow sight on it in fact this this looks like the prototype mp7 hollow sight that half-life just took Oh, did I not, uh... There we go. So now we have a grenade launcher on this, uh, MP7. You'll still probably have to build your own MP5 with the grenade launcher, but, uh... You know, people have done that before, so... Not really a new thing in H3 VR. But yeah, let's try uh, attachments. See if the... Uh, oh no. Let's go with a different uh, suppressor. Something a little small. Let's see. Hold on just a second. The Nagon suppressor might work. There we go. In fact, I kind of like that look, right? But, uh, yeah. <laughs> this is pretty cool. Come on, <laughs> get in there. Oh, wait, do I already have a... Oh, I do. <laughs> Forgot about that. But, yeah. I mean, it's your standard MP7. Nothing really different about it, except for maybe uh, the hollow sight and the grenade launcher, which, let me just uh, compare it to the original. EDW. One of my favorite, favorite uh, guns. Oh, he took off the rails on the side. Nice. Okay. I have, a, I have an airsoft version of uh, the MP7, and that's what I usually do. I take off the rails because it's a little too heavy, you know, so. I don't have any like flashlights or anything like that but, <laughs> but yeah you know so not much uh, in terms of difference take off the iron sights take off these rails add the grenade launcher add the little hollow sight which is pretty cool <laughs> all right that's nice all right let's just uh, put this stuff away for right now and focus on some of the other stuff. Oh, now we got something new and unique here. This is the AR-3. Wait, hold on. This is the Sustenance AR-3. We forgot. When does this do? I want to look at all these controls. Okay, that's safe. That's probably fire. Huh. All right. Well, let's stick a uh, box magazine and, ooh. Special boy here will uh, uh, show off later. But uh, all right, just uh, this. Uh, okay, and uh, oh, there's a charging handle there. That boy there, and uh, we're good to go. Where's the uh, grip point here? Whoa, okay. It just stopped firing. Is it empty? Huh, maybe it's empty. Okay. Well, we'll put another mag in. I guess uh, that might be a problem. Unless that's supposed to be like that. See? Huh. That is, uh, unique. Uh, I think that's probably supposed to be like that, right? Where just like, uh, you can still have the belt, but the gun is technically empty. It's not really ammunition, but, uh, yeah, you know, whatever. That's fine. I can get used to that. Make sure that's all pulled back. And let's try the uh, lemon launcher here. 
you know, you want to say combustible lemons, you know, get your uh, Portal 2 Cave Johnson jokes out there, but this is a dark matter lemon. Now, how do we fire? Oh, it's the, uh, to charge uh, the dark matter lemon up, you use your uh, non-dominant hand over here. You pull the trigger. It'd be better if we had some sausage in the scene. Spawn a lot of these babies. Yeah, I really think that is a bug, though. Hmm. That is a bug. I think Anton will fix that. Yeah, that's a bug. Anton, uh, sh should be able to fix that later on. Yep, see? It's completely empty, but we still got a belt there, so. But yeah, you know, I mean, it's pretty cool. Let me see if I can attach some attachments to it. Doesn't seem like it. No muzzle devices. Let me load up a, uh, oh, well, I already had one there. but Nope, okay. There's no rails anywhere. You can put, uh... You can put stuff on, like scopes and stuff. Let me just try that. Grab a... One of these. Nope. Okay. That's fine. That's, that's okay, you know. I'm fine with that. I mean, it is a pretty cool... Pretty cool little rifle. we have got, uh... Sausage over there, so let's, uh... I love how the lemon screams as it releases its dark energy upon But yeah, there's the uh, AR-3 for you. Really cool stuff. All right, let me just reload the scene here. Boost up a lot of uh, magazines all over the place. I know I could just clean it up, but uh, it's fast. It's just do a, a complete scene reload. Ooh, let's check out the spam, which is basically a funny copy of the slam, the selectable lightweight... Oh god, what, what what was the thing again? Anti-personnel munition? I forgot what it was, uh, I forgot what SLAM stood for, but, uh... Well, let me just, uh, spawn lock this, and, uh, yeah, we got the SLAM. Now... I think that's how you arm this. Oops. No, oh, hold on. Oh. Whoa. Oh no. But can we just stick out on the wall? Nope. We need to... Hold on just a second. It takes, uh, it takes a while for the stuff to... for me to figure this out. <laughs> Alright. Alright. 
Wait, hold on. If you open this up, it'll stick to the wall, right? Okay. And then if you... If you break the laser, you can see there's a little tiny laser. You can, can you see it? I don't think it's going to go blow up on me. right? But you can see the laser, right? So if a Salsig or any other kind of entity walks through that... Not me, though, right? Okay. Good. Not me. <laughs> All right. Can we disarm these, uh, slam? Oh, we can. Nice. And I think this is, this works like a regular. Oh, no, maybe. Just, I need to figure out where this thing is. Okay, there it is. All right, there. So if we just throw this. Okay. So that's the, uh, that's the process that you need to do. To arm it, you have to turn this dial right here, and then you can throw it, like a satchel charge, pick up the little detonator, the clacker. Alright, but if you want to stick it to walls, open this thing up, then you arm it. Oh no, wait. Oh no, it arms itself. Okay, I see. Oops. Okay. <laughs> so basically, if you want to stick it to walls... You have to... Oops, I died. Which is uh, <laughs> a risk when you... Uh... But yeah, you take it, open it up, take it to the wall. Okay. There's that laser. Spawn a Sosig. Oh no. And uh, we're just going to wander around. Somebody's got to run into this, uh... Well, you know what? Enemy bots? Here, come on. Jinkies. Also guns? Oh no. Oh no. Okay. Hey guys. Come on. Oh no, he went under. Oops. There we go. A little uh, slam bowling here. Oh. No. Double me. I think that's all of them. It's over there. Huh? Let's check this no. out. Oops. <laughs> A little surprise for him. Blew up. Huh? Oops. Hey. I think that's all of them. Oh 
Oh no, not all of them. Come on, come here. Oh no. Oh, I died. I need to clear out these SOSIGs. Uh, disabled, disabled. They're all SOSIGs. SOSIGs. Okay. Let me just reload the scene. So that's the slam. Pretty cool. And the last thing that we got is the uh, sustenance crossbow. Which is a... <laughs> look at this hot dog rod. And then a battery. So I think we need to put the battery on. Automatically pulls back on the uh, string there. Alright, cool, cool. No other external controls to speak of. You know what? I think I'm going to put a scope on this. Let's do a 3 by 12. No, 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 no. A 1 by 24. Oh, okay, there we go. Let's increase this to... Oops. Three. There we go. And, all right, so we got everything ready. Let's stick one of these uh, hot dog rods in here. Let's spawn some SOSIGs. I wonder what happens if you don't charge it up, though, because you're supposed to charge up the uh, bolt. <laughs> it just flies off and hits them in the face and just explodes into meaty chunks. That is cool. I like that Anton thought of that. It's basically a like a dart gun at this point, you know? It doesn't hurt them. But if you hold down the trigger and charge it up, ooh, nice. Roasting very nice. That's too bad they don't catch fire, but uh uh, you leave them on the grill for too long, they kind of, they kind of, you know, turn black and catch fire. But so basically, you can pre-charge your your um, hot dog rod uh, and uh, make them hard as concrete, and I'm out of gas. yeah, they become little uh, arrow bolts. So you know. Let's find someone next to a wall or something. Maybe we can, uh, I'm real close. Time to file my work there we go. Do a little bit of a, yeah, I can't. No. He's stuck to the wall there, so. <laughs> I really think that this should be on the shoulder, right? Ooh, nice. Oh, I love this. But you got to make sure that your uh, hot dog rods are cooked. Because if not, Way to go, champ. they'll just bounce off or splatter on your enemies. <laughs> nope. Oh, this guy's got a face mask. Maybe we can penetrate it. Guess I'm out. Ooh, nice. Let's uh, get this guy over here. He's a little uh, farther. Ooh. You'd think he's dead, but he's just pinned up against the wall. <laughs> oh, that's nice.
Ooh, let's uh get this this guy right there. You see that guy? Where is he? Not that guy. That guy. All right. Do a long range snipe here. Got him. But this guy right here. A little bit of a drop, so you gotta aim a little higher. Ooh, nice, right in the noggin. <laughs> this is so cool. I can't wait for more crossbows in the game. I'm a wiener. But what if you don't what if you don't charge all the way? Like you like maybe a twenty five percent roast? You know? Still, I think it still breaks up, but let's, uh, yep, nope, doesn't do that much damage, so let's try a little bit more. Time to file my workers In fact, I think I should get a laser sight for this. Get a laser, where is a laser? There it is. Uh, I'm looking for it. Oh, the small one here. Right there. Okay. Good. All right. Time to file my workers' comp. Okay. Yeah, it still penetrates them. All the way. Bright light. Nope, that's my cell phone. <laughs> Whoops. It was like a tiny millisecond. One, two. All right. One, two, three. Not any so about three seconds. About three. Well, not seconds. Those are. Let's see. Uh, one, two. About uh, two seconds. Like. One. Nope. So yeah, about two seconds. One, two. Oh, we got two guys over here. Look at this. Let's try to go get a double. One, two. You go, champ. Ah, I didn't get it. Ah. I got one of them. Guys yeah, survived. All right, you know what? Let's try. This might be a good, uh, good test. Oh, no, no, no. This might be a good test right here. Make it all, like, uh, charged up here. Oh, right in the throat. Yeah, they need to be next to each other. Let's just drag this guy over here. Hey there. Get up. There you go. Oh, there we go. Two for one deal. <laughs> but yeah, there's the uh, crossbow for you. Really, really nice. Uh, let me see. Where am I in my room exactly? Turn on the light there. All right. But yeah, that's the crossbow. Pretty cool. I don't know why you can spawn lock batteries. But, uh, yeah, still pretty cool. If there's anything else in here that I'm missing. Nope. Seem like it. All right. Well, that should be the end of the weapons. Oh, the uh, Graviton Beamer, which is actually, if I remember correctly, it's actually in the the support uh, tab now. So you have a Graviton Beamer there, along with the uh, Sustenance Crossbow. And, of course, these weapons are in their spots, like the uh, USB match right here, and then the... Uh, EDW is right there. Okay. And the... Where is this AR-3? I want to say carbine. Might be assault rifle, right? No, hold on. Battle rifle? Should be... In the... 
support. Maybe? Oh, there it is. Okay. So it's a support weapon. All right, cool. Cool. Got it. Everything should be in the item spawner. And before we go, let's do the new take and hold character. Take and hold here. And check out the... Uh... Well, take and hold. All right, so now we got a new category, like Anton said. Meme-tastic meats. So hopefully we get some more other other meme uh, loadouts later on. Maybe a little Die Hard, maybe a little, uh, uh, you know, Matrix. Who knows? But that's a good category. This is for serious stuff, you know? Well, serious. Serious. Uh, that's... But this is for, like, the, you know, the media stuff, right? So we got the uh, Well Done Free Meat. Spawns with a crowbar. But I'm just going to cheese it for today, and I'm going to uh, make myself, uh, let's see, custom health. Uh, standard, arcade, yeah, I'll just keep those. Uh, item spawner enabled. All the uh, music on, narration on. All right, five hold standard. All right, cool. Let's play some take and hold. And uh, hopefully I have charge because I've been playing a lot of Half-Life Alex lately. <laughs> I charged my controllers that one day, so. It'd be okay. Adjust my headset here. Pop my back. Because uh, it's something I do. I don't think you can hear it. Hopefully you didn't. Nice crack. Okay. Uplink successful. Target system detected. Take it. Oh, the, I'm so used to Half-Life Alex, you know, I'm going to teleport or something. No, I need Arm Swinger, so I got to get used to that. All right, so we've got ourselves a crowbar. Um. Hmm. Should I start off with a weapon or not? Well, I can go to a supply point, but I'll just make note of where this uh, item spawner is in case I need it. Let's just go with the crowbar. Half-life style. Give me these, uh, ooh, stun baton. That's a new, uh, saucer weapon I haven't seen. Okay. Override token found. All right, so let's check out our first weapon. Half-Life weapon. Oop. Ah, USP. 9 millimeter, I suppose. Yep, it's got the glow sights on it, so... Man. All right. Sure, I don't need anything else here. Nope. I only have one, so... Okay, let's go take our hold point. Hopefully I get slams later on. I might just spawn them. Yeah, you know what? I should spawn a couple of slams. Maybe I might get them during my run and take and hold, but uh I don't know. It's just uh we'll see. But I think I really should spawn some, so. Let's see. Here. Ah, here we go. Let's go spawn those slams. Support grenade. Spam, sorry. Spam grenades there, plus the detonator. Stick into the slot there. Okay. Hmm, no, 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 no. 
All right. Okay, then. Let's go to the hold point. And, uh, capture it. Oh, so used to Half-Life Alex. I pressed the grip to release the mag when, uh, not grip. Yeah, it is not the grip button to release the uh, magazine. It is touchpad. Need to remember that. Okay. All right. You know what we need to do, right? Let's get some slams on the doors here. Oh, nice. I love these things. I know it's a little uh, cheaty to immediately use them. But okay. Interfacing with system node. Hold this position. Analyzing system. Ooh, nice. Not grip to release touchpad. Go. Oh. Well, at least you can shoot them, which is nice. Grip not release mag milk. Just leave little presents behind, you know? Actually, fire upon the uh, zombie headcrabs or 
the uh, head crab zombies. The bun crab. Bun crab? Meat crab. Well, they're buns now, so. Oh, that's, uh, that's new. Ooh. What can I get here? A laser. Let's go with a, uh... Ospo. Nice. Uh, maybe I should spawn lock this. Just in case it runs out. Can I put it here? No. Oh, is that a, uh... Follow sight? Nice. Ooh, somebody <laughs> went into my, ran into my, uh, my booby trap. Feel bad for those guys. No, no, stay away. Stay away. Whoa, 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 whoa. What the? Oh my goodness. <laughs> the buns. They're like head crabs. Oh my goodness, man, what was that? It was just like a blinding white light. I don't know if you can see that, but... Uh... Ooh, okay, well... Let's see what this is. Is this health? Ah, why not? All right, go to that hold point. Oh, nope, not this way. I miss the speed, you know? I mean, Half-Life Alex is pretty fun, but it's very slow. Ooh, got him. Ooh. Check out these weapons they got. MP7s. And what is this? It's a bun grenade. Oh, no. I don't know what this does. Oh, oh no, that's not good. Are you my friend or are you my enemy? I think you're my enemy. Ugh. So we got little man hacks and stuff. No, 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 no. <laughs> no, you don't. That'd be really cool if those man hacks were your uh, allies. But... That's okay. Let us put some... Mines here. 
through these doorways. Put a couple more of these babies in there. <laughs> oh, that one's a little too high. <laughs> I just love doing this. Oh. Okay, stick that one on there. Nobody's going to be able to get to me. <laughs> All right, I think that's enough. There's nobody back here anyways, so... I don't think anything spawns back here. Nope. Alright, you know what? One more. Two more. There we go. Woo! <laughs> and a couple of... Oh, no! Ugh, patrols, man. These patrols. Alright, I'm just gonna drop a couple, uh, grenades, uh, not grenades, uh, satchel charges. Interfacing with system node. Hold this position. Analyzing system. That's not the right one. Oh no! Advance to next system node and take it. Okay. <clears throat> a little issue with those uh, slam mines, but uh, that's all just because I'm pretty bad. Ooh. No.
two. Oh, man. Wish that area for activating the tripwire was bigger. Oh no. Oh, come on. Oh, I really wish that these uh, areas were bigger. Oh, man. Okay. Wow, dude. Just wow. Another crossbow? Really? <laughs> Doesn't really help at all. Wow. All right. Well, you know what? I'm going to go find that, uh, I'm going to go find that, uh, spawn, uh, item spawner, and I'm going to get myself an assault rifle or the AR-3. I should do that instead. <laughs> no, I just need to go downstairs. Oh, nope, I don't want to go there. Come on, where is it? Oh, no, I went through there. Oh, those are, I think that's what... Yeah, these look like grenades, right? So those are the things that are doing damage to me. Huh. Override token found. Oh, it's boss 12. Nice. I don't have any space for this though. I might as well just come on, there we go. Hmm. You know what?
So wait, that's uh hold on. No, nope, no, nope. hold on. Three, four, five, six. Hmm. Six. Ten, right? Ten. Eight, nine, eight. Hmm. Six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, somebody ran into my, uh, my trap. <laughs> gotcha. Could have got a submachine gun. Override token found. I hear them. <laughs> putting all these kind of traps Ooh, here we go we got one over here okay good oh man What is that?
Oops. Analyzing system. Get off me. Zombies. Gotcha. Oh man, I really wish that's that area where you could activate is larger. Cause that sucks. It's very tiny. Oh. I reload, gotta reload, gotta reload. Off my face. Go to the uh, supply point here. See if I can get something. Oh. Override token found. Okay. Let me go to the other ones. Off me. <laughs> okay, uh, one more. Oh, 
Who are you? Oh. Why are you not dead? Oh, grenade. this hold point first. Oh. Over there. It's okay for right now. I'm just gonna go and check out this. Boom. Boom. Override token found. Nice. I need these. Okay. Ooh, gravity gun. There's that assault rifle that I could have gotten. Oh no. Oh no! Shotgun. Nope, I don't want that. I want the be a rifle or something at least. Give me this. I wish these uh these shells would be oriented in a better position. Cause You better be dead, right? Okay. Still got my shotgun. Let's just put that there for right now. to do oh man like i said these these activation points need to be a little uh, larger okay 
Hold on just a second. I gotta make sure all this stuff in my room is not <laughs> getting my way. Okay. Interfacing with system node. Hold this position. Oh, these are terrible spots. Analyzing system. No! <laughs> really sucks for left-handed players. You know what? I think this recording is getting a little too long. So I'm just going to take the next hold with this thing. Because. Pretty good. Oops. Oh my goodness. Are you kidding me? bother with you. Damn, my cord getting tangled. Bad spots, bad spots. Here we go. Analyzing system. Oh, 
serious? Please die. Man, they just shrug off bullets, don't they? My goodness. Wow, man, this is tough. <laughs> Five override tokens. Oh. Advance to next system node and take it. My back hurts. Returning to interface. <laughs> but there we go. That was the uh, new Half-Life character in Taken Hold, along with some of the new weapons. Oh, that was tough, man. Wow. Holy crap. Especially those combine um, sausages, right? With like the impenetrable armor. Basically, just had to like keep shooting them in, until like the the blunt force damage, you know, killed them. It's like, man, probably needed to get the uh, MP7 or something. But uh, holy crap, man, that was that was hard. <laughs> but uh, yeah, that's about it for today. I'm. I'm tired. I need to take a break. I'll see you guys next time.